Writer. P H Studios. Studio. What's your special encounter with God? Like when you were down and out? Ako or I have. Um, na alala ko year 2010, 2009. I, I had a project with direct Jeffrey Jeterian, um called Reputation in ABS-CBN, and then I was also doing No Other Woman for Star City Man Viva. And then, obviously, um, every day ako nag-work nun, over-fatigued na ako, um, low immune system, pinamaan ako ng virus called um, meningitis. So, uh, mag-convulsion ako sa set ng reputasyon. They, they rushed me to the hospital. And then I stayed in the hospital for almost a month. So I was thinking they couldn't uh, find out what was going on with me. So they had to get like a water thing sa spine ko to, to examine the water in my brain. And then, yun nga, they found out it's de- meningitis and it's deadly. So parang ako nag pray na ako kay God nun. Sabi ko, um, I can't die. I, I wanna live. So, kasi sa hospitals, di ba, kat, kat yung bed mo, yung wall, laging merong crucifix doon. So, I remember parang I think um, I was fighting for my life. Uh, I can't die. Even though I was super weak. Super weak. And then, I guess, after a week of fighting for my life, um, lumakas ako bigla. And, yun, parang sabi ng mga doctors kasi it's really the your body will fight for the ano eh, for yourself eh, yung mga yung mga virus kaya so I guess God gave me strength to fight because I asked for it and I didn't wanna give up yeah here you go uh, there was a time back in well, it wasn't just one specific time it was siguro the whole course of 2018, late 2018 until late 2019, the whole entire year. Um, I was in a I was in a tough position, tough spot, and there were certain things that I was praying for night after night, kapi kapi talaga. And I was just saying, God, talaga, if if you just give me or show me how I can make it there. Give me this opportunity para makarating ako dun, para maging okay, para maging clear yung kailangan kong gawin. And every day, he gave me some way, an opportunity or a sign na darating ka dun, darating ka dun. So it wasn't just one night eh, it wasn't just one night. It was how many nights of me doing this, the same routine, same prayer, asking for the same. One year, sabi mo. One year, I think a little bit longer pa nga one year. Well, let's just say one year na lang. And he would, he would give me signs like, in the weirdest ways, whether it be somebody I would see who would say something to me na parang may double meaning, na parang, I don't know, this is God's way of telling me that I'm supposed to do this. Or parang this is God's way of saying, I shouldn't go here or do that. And then until it all made sense, and it brought me back to where I am today. And I have no one else to thank but him talaga kahit kung paano ko patignan, parang it's sobrang perfect naman kung sabi ko coincidence nangyari lahat ng nangyari. So I know, I know it's a higher power. I know it was God. And I wish I could be more specific about what those things were, but I'll leave it muna at that. But I know talaga it was a higher power controlling yung mga nangyayari. Uh, sobrang galing talaga. Amazing yung power at yung, yung kaya niyang gawin. Studios. Studios.